everyone welcome back to smart tech junction in this video tutorial guys i am going to show you if your windows 11 pc is not downloading or not installing the new windows 11 25 h2 update so if you are also facing the same problem don't worry in this video i am going to show you all the working method to fix this update problem completely so let's get started so as you can see guys in my screen windows 11 version 25 h2 is available but it is not download downloading and installing so first solution is this guys to fix this problem we start your windows update services to do this guys hold windows key button and then press r from your keyboard and here we need to type services.msc and then hit enter from your keyboard okay like this now here we need to find out windows update services right click on it and here from here you need to restart it after restarting go to properties and in the startup type extend and set it to automatic and then click on start click on apply and then click on ok that's it now you need to find out other service background intelligent transfer service okay same you need to also restart and change the startup type of this go to properties in the startup type select automatically click on start click on apply and then click on ok and then you need to find out cryptographic service you need to right click on it go to properties and in the startup type select automatic click on start click on apply and then click on ok now you need to try to update your pc once again to 25 h2 so just click on download and install button so it will now start the downloading process if the problem is same you can try the next method now you need to check the internet connection of your pc so in case the internet connection is not good at that time you can definitely face this type of problem so just you need to cross check your internet connection by opening other thing like google chrome browser try to play any other videos online and let's see how your internet is performing if there is no internet connection you can definitely face this type of problem issues on your pc you need to sort out the internet connection and then if the internet connection is very good afterwards you're facing the same problem now you can try the next method now you need to clear the windows update cache on your pc to do this guys hold windows key button and then press r from your keyboard and here you need to type c colon slash windows slash software distribution same as it is you need to type and then hit enter from your keyboard select all files from here and then delete them this clean all corrupted update file and then after deleting these guys you need to restart your pc one time after restarting now once again try to update your pc it will fix your problem still the problem is same you can try the next method once again open your windows settings okay go to system and in the right panel scroll down and find out troubleshoot in the troubleshoot go to other troubleshooter like this and then simply you need to run the windows update troubleshooter so just click on run button it will start the windows update troubleshooter follow the on screen suggestion and to fix the problem step by step okay just try this method and it will show you the exact problem and the solution after doing this guys try to update your pc if the problem is still same now you can try the next method now you need to open the command prompt press windows key button and here you need to type cmd means command prompt and you need to run command prompt in administrator mode okay like this and here you need to type some command so uh, this command you can get in my video description so from there you can easily copy and paste after typing each command hit enter okay and then after the process was complete then copy the other command paste it here as it is and then hit enter so there are six to seven command you need to follow the same process this command completely reset your windows update and fix the most stuck update issue on your pc so this method is very powerful you need to try this after doing this guys still the problem is same you can try the next method you need to check tpm secure boot and requirement to check the tpm hold the windows key button and then press r from your keyboard in the run box you need to type tpm.msc and then hit enter if the tpm is not available so you can get the message here the tpm is not available if the tpm is available you can see this type of message and one one more thing you need to see the secure boot is on or not on your pc to check these guys press windows key button and here you need to search system information and here you need to find out the secure boot if the secure boot is enabled 
at that time you can easily able to uh, go with windows 11 25 h2 also you need to check your bios mode to uefi so this is the main mandatory requirement to update your pc to latest version of windows 11 also you need to have the 4 gb ram 64 gb storage and a supported cpu if your pc meets this all requirement and then go to once again your windows settings go to windows update and now just click on download and install it will officially update your pc so if the problem is still there you can try the next method if built-in update does not work you need you can download the windows 11 update assistant from the microsoft official website and run it from there so this process will take lots of time if you want a dedicated video tutorial on this topic please comment down below is more comment is there so i will definitely make a dedicated video on this as a final option you can try this method okay if this video help you make sure to like share and subscribe to smart tech junction for more windows tutorial thanks for watching see you in the next one